Now we have to say then whether the area that we've just calculated for R is an overestimate or an underestimate. Well clearly it's going to be an overestimate. And why? Because when we were calculating the areas of the trapeziums, like this one for instance, if I was to enlarge this area then essentially what we've got is part of the curve coming around like this and I'm drawing that blue line across here. So can you see that if I drop that down to the x-axis, any one of these trapeziums in here, then the area that we were working out was this area through here, okay, which clearly is much more than, well I say much more, but it's just a little bit more than the area underneath the red curve down to the x-axis. Okay, so basically then it's an overestimate. Okay, and reason I would put as something along the lines that trapeziums are above the curve. Let's just put that in there, above the curve. Alright.